A very common action that you might want to perform on a table is to sort the rows by one of the columns. In the case that if that column contains strings, then we would essentially be alphabetizing the rows by that string. If it's numbers, then we could order the rows either by increasing or decreasing numbers. It's actually um, quite easy to do this sorting. Um, so let's go ahead and, um, and uh, do a little bit of work on the spreadsheet. So this time I am going to read in a different spreadsheet um, using a URL. This one contains information about CO2 emissions, but instead of being based on sector, they're based on different types of fuel. So we'll go ahead and read it in. And then uh, again, the state column is um, just one of the generic columns. And I would prefer for that to be the road labels rather than a generic column. So that's why I went ahead and set the index to be state. So we can see that this table also has this problematic total line that I talked about before. So I'm going to go ahead and tell it to drop the total line. And now I see that the, that, that line is uh, missing. Um, now I'm going to go ahead and, and perform a sort. So first I will show you what happens if you don't specify what kind of sort. If you don't specify it, then the uh, sorting will be um, from lowest to highest. So if we look at the total million metric tons for each of the states, we can see District of Columbia, which has the smallest total, is listed at the top of the list. Now, if I wanted to um, have them in descending order, then I have to um, provide an additional argument, this one, ascending equals false. So if I don't provide this value, it will assume that ascending is equal to true. But if I want it to be descending, I have to say ascending equals false. And I'm going to go ahead and modify it in place so that my um, new uh, version of the uh, data frame will be sorted from largest to smallest. So if I do this, now I can see that Texas, which has the largest million metric tons of CO2 emissions, is at the top of the list, followed distantly by California, Florida, and the other states.